Hello, hello. So the first thing I learned early on is that you can use a torch in the mid-battle. This is especially helpful for long drawn-out battles when you're facing opponents who can lower the torch light. Take the time to look up which items can create positive results from the curios, such as holy water for altars. Take every advantage you can. You may think using skills that hit multiple enemies is effective, but then in the long run, single targeting makes more of a difference. Unless you are 100% sure the skill will kill at least one of your opponents, do not use it. This is a game where you should always treat it as if you are always one attack from an opponent critically hitting you to death's door or stressing you to affliction. Holy Water adds resistance buffs to your team when dealing with opponents who bleed, stun, or blight. Imagine the difference a little resistance can make. You think this game is your friend, but it's not. I've had many fell weeks. It's made me want to give up many times. But don't. Keep pushing. This is not a sprint, it's a marathon. Never forget that. You want to know what it's like to clear hordes and hordes of enemies? This is your game. Never forget those words that you see at the beginning of this game. Bonus tip. Never be scared to try new combinations of parties. Do not hesitate to research how you will apply those. Strategy guides can be helpful, but the only way to be successful with this game is to think smart or be extremely lucky. Happy gaming.